fled fierce city. Is it worth a buy? <laughs> Let's read the words of the words of the... Uh, of... This is a first-person shooting action game. Players are surrounded by enemies. Players are free to explore the surrounding area. Players need to avoid the enemy's attack or kill the enemy. Killing an enemy can rob the enemy of his weapon. Keep your health as long as possible. Before I get into this, I want you to know that this is £13.99, pence, which is the only reason I picked it for review, because it was first-person shooter for like £14. Uh, that's around about 20 USD. So I, I just kind of thought, it's got to be half decent. I'm, I'm into first-person shooters. And um, this is what I got. This is, no, no menu, nothing. You, you press play on Steam and you come straight into this. This abomination of asset-flipping brownness. That's all it is. That's all it is. You just shoot the enemy in the face and they, they'll run up to you and die. Then you pick up their gun if you want it and just shoot more enemies in the face. You then run around an absolutely brown, awful, horrible map where there's birds that you just can't shoot and there's just random enemies just standing there, just standing there, falling through rocks. There's no, it's not a game. All this is, is the basic kind of thing you can do with Unity. Just, oh, there's, there's, there's some soldiers, uh, yeah, AI, yeah, that's just, yeah, we'll have AI. Uh, a rock there, windmill there, bridge there, bird, 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 bird. $13.99, please. It's the quickest review I've ever done. It took me 10 minutes to apply for a refund, where I wasn't happy, I wasn't happy. Um, so my message to Steam was quite, you know, it was, this total abomination should be removed from Steam, placed on a USB, taken to Jupiter's fifth moon, where a drilling rig will burrow 50,000 miles into the moon's core, where this festering pile of garbage should be buried for all eternity. It's a total cash grab, zero gameplay, just random assets dropped on a brown map, throw in a few enemies, and there you go, 1399, please. Do Steam even have quality control? I did get a refund, guys, but there's something else going down here. There's something else going down here, Holmes. Oh yeah. Something else is going down here, Holmes. Let's see if you can guess what it is, guys. I've gone to a completely different game on Steam by a completely different developer. The game is called Undercover Brother, guys. And let's read the words the words of probably the same guy. This is a first-person action shooting game. Players are free to explore their surroundings. Players are surrounded by enemies. Players can kill enemies or avoid enemy attacks. After killing the enemy, you can pick up the enemy's weapons. Players need to keep their health as long as possible. Pretty much identical words, pretty much identical brown map, pretty much identical weapons, pretty much identical assets. And everybody calls Epic Game Store a pile of f***ing shite. Steam peddling this bullshit. No quality control. 30, this is 15, 49. This is even more money than the last f***er. Now I've never played Undercover Brother and I never will. But I can say one thing guys. Fled Fierce City is the biggest pile of festering ocelot sperm bank inducing anal cavity f***. Diarrhea fierce trash that I've ever, ever, ever played. It's even worse than Galactic fucking Hitman. And you could beat that whole game crouched. Now, their weapons will only fire at chest height. Chest height, guys. So if you crouch, <laughs> if you crouch, guys, if you fucking crouch, if you, if you crouch, guys, they can't hit you can't hit you. So you just walk through the whole game crouched and you beat the game. That's it. That's it. Yeah. That's it. 